What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We've got a lot to chat about today, so let's get straight into it. All right, guys, I've been following what happened with JJ DeBoss and Trisha on the set of America's List, and it looks like Trisha has been released from the hospital following her unfortunate accident that involved her husband JJ in Texas while filming season two of Street Outlaws America's List. Everybody seemed to be okay and in good spirits. Even Trisha was her usual feisty little self as she was shown sporting a wheelchair as JJ pushed her out the doors of the hospital in Texas. Also seen in the video is Chelsea helping out as always and carrying all of Trisha's belongings. Um, it's good to know that she is going home to be with her family because I know how much family means to all of them. Uh, JJ also suffered injuries in the accident as well, including severe burns to his face and hands, while Trisha had to undergo surgery for her injuries and have screws placed in her hips. So I'm going to go ahead and probably assume that means a crap load of physical therapy in her future as well. So prayers going up for her speedy recovery. Meanwhile, back on the set, the boys are working hard to repair the damages the cars sustained in the accident so they can get back to racing. You got to love that about JJ and the MSO. They will not lay down. They will not quit. They will work day and night until they get them cars back on the streets. JJ also stated they were going to take the similar Pro Charge Hemi from Zip Tie and put that power plant in the Hummingbird and Zip Tie will head off to the chassis shop to undergo major damage repair. After all the bad luck they have had, though, hopefully they can salvage a decent spot on America's list. I sure did hate to see all this happen because I know how hard they work to make it happen. So it is hard to see, but I'm guessing the newly pro-charged heifer will be stepping in the ring while zip tie is down. So be on the lookout for that. And y'all drop me a comment down below and let me know what y'all think. And that's going to be it for this one, guys. So super glad Trisha is headed home to be with her family. Everyone, please remember JJ, Trisha, and their MSO family in your prayers as they continue their recovery. Can't wait to see these two back behind the wheel chopping off heads. Also, don't forget to drop a comment down below and let me know if you think that Heifer will step in and take over while Zip Ties Down. And be sure and check us out on all social media platforms. Links are in the dashboard, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll catch y'all on the next one.